Alright, so here's the cutlass. Finally able to get a video of it. Man, there's so much to say about it. What can I say? Well, let's start under the hood. We uh, got the Edelbrock RPM high-rise intake with date-coded uh, Q-Jet underneath that with a four-barrel. Got a W31 cam in it. Got a four-core radiator. Um, you guys know that I got in that accident. Pretty much uh, tried to get the fender uh, and door lined up as much as possible. Let's see how it looks there. And it looks fairly decent. Yeah, it's uh, got over about a 150 hours invested in just that this little section right here and man there's only like an eighth of uh, body filler in there so we got the hammer and dolly out and pounded it out pretty good anyway there's a uh, all new suspension up front all along with a CPP uh, disc brake conversion kit with a master cylinder and stuff and everything and booster and uh, it's pretty much got the new center link, uh, vintage wheel works, V45, uh, 15 by 7s in the front, 15 8s in the back. Uh, but it's got a center link, uh, tie rod ends, uh, idle arm, springs, pretty much the whole bang. Ball joints, bushings, everything's all uh, redone on the front end as far as the back end too. It's also got new springs. It's also got a sway bar, which is the one inch sway bar. New exhaust, Flowmaster exhaust, two and a half inch with an H pipe. And uh, it's got KYBs on all four corners. It uh, handles fairly good for, you know, brand new stock suspension. So, uh, but on the inside, let's see what we got on the inside. It used to be uh, that uh, goldish tan color. Now it's uh, dyed it black with a little bit of uh, silver on that, on the dash. Got uh, the door panels going on along with the back seat because they're out right now. Got the Pro Car buckets from OPG. They're very comfortable seats. I recommend them to anybody who wants to buy them. They're definitely worth the money. Talk about comfortability with modern innovation. With that old classic look. Anyway, this is the beast. Uh, what else can I say about it? That's pretty much it. Uh, I'm starting on the new side right here. This uh, passenger side, getting the fender done up. Uh, Looking for highs and low spots, a little bit of high spots right there, and low spot right there. And uh, got the grills out and stuff because I was working on the, the engine and stuff, so I had to pull out the radiator and whatnot. So, anyway, that'll be it. I'll have another video up soon of uh, what she sounds like. There you guys.